Okay, so let's have a little conversation about AI employees for a moment and using AI. And I know most of us have experiment, experimented, that's the word, with, um, you know, chat GPT and going over to Claude and perplexity and, and um, you know, Google AI studio and, and all, all sorts of other stuff that we've done so far, right? And um, we some of us have even created little projects and, and GPTs, but I want to talk about true AI employees or as close to AI employees as, as we've come. And I want to show you something. And and as I pull this up, you're going to see, yeah, this was done in Hey Gen. You're going to say, well, I've already seen Hey Gen TV, but I want you to stay with me. Stay with me for a little while on this. Some cutting edge tools that can help optimize your workflow. NHS app with prescription tracking. While primarily... So you've seen Hey Gen before, I'm sure, um, or heard of it, and, and it creates videos. And, and yeah, that wasn't me. I didn't do that recording. None of that was me. But that's what HeyGen does. So you're thinking, well, that's not an AI employee at TB. You just hired a tool or got a tool that, that did that for you, right? Well, let me say that that entire thing was created without human input, at least throughout the whole process. So let me show you how that works real quick. It all starts right here in this Airtable base that we have. And in this Airtable base, we have a list of topics, okay? So we have this, this, it's a short list right now, but it's a list of three topics. So this is the only thing that a human has to do. The human right now populates this list of topics. Everything else, including all the way up and through, including creation of that video, and heck, even if I wanted to post it to YouTube, all done by AI employees. So let me show you how that works really quickly. So coming in here, Okay, this is N8N, if you've never heard of it, it's a low-code, no-code tool. And it's one of the things that we use internally to build a lot of different um, AI employees. And this is one. And so what this one does is it goes out to Airtable, to this table right here, and it picks up a topic. It picks up a topic and then it has a couple different agents in here that go through and create an outline for the topic, research the topic, and then actually write about the topic and create the content. Okay, it's making sure we're creating really, really great content. Once it does all of that, it drops what it created back into Airtable into this table here. And so this was the topic. Here was, um, when it does the research, it, it typically will come up with four to six different subtopics to talk about. So here's one of the subtopics it chose. Um, and then here is the actual content that it created. It went out and researched, and it did this. Even gave citations to where it found its content in case you, 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 know, you thought it was hallucinating. It'll tell you exactly where it got it from. Okay, so it does that. We've created the content in written form. Great. Now, there's a lot that we can do with that. We could even stop right there. You can take that and post that um, as a blog or use it in other places. But why stop there? Now, all of this runs on its own, y'all. None of this is triggered by a human ever. All of this runs on its own. When that article is dropped in, then this workflow picks up and it goes out to Airtable, it picks it up, then it sends it over to HeyGen to create the video. It receives the video from HeyGen and then drops it back into Airtable here. Now, we're not posting this to YouTube because this is going in my newsletter. Um, and so it, it is a little bit during the human for us in our process does get in at this point, but just think about it for a moment. All of that was done without any human in the loop. All of that was done by AI employees who were able to make decisions, to do research, to figure out what needs to be done and drop something in. And it all started with creating this list of topics. Well, that's what we do right now. Guess what? Within the, probably the next week and a half, we won't even have a human dropping these topics in anymore okay because what we are building right now is a campaign builder that actually will take your um the, the the type of campaign you want 
whatever your objective is, who your audience is, which we've got more data on that as well, and then build an entire messaging strategy, everything that you need to build out an entire campaign across multiple channels all right here. And so as we go through and you see week one, week, uh, the dates and everything, here the content, guess what that is? It's a topic that gets dropped in and we can create content off of this automatically, yes. So we have an AI employee that produces this campaign builder, okay? We have a campaign builder AI employee that's producing this. That's going to get dropped into Airtable. Then the research is going to be done. Once the research is done, it's going to get turned into video content. So this is what we're doing now for several of our clients um, who have said, hey, I don't want to be on camera. Uh, but I need to create video content. How can I do that? And I don't want to create faceless video. Um, my audience does need to see me and, and connect with me. How do I do that? Well, this is it. This is it. But it starts. It starts. It starts with having a solid foundation. You know, I've seen people run out trying to do this and, and, and it's flopping on them. And it's flopping on them because they don't have the solid marketing foundation. So many of us don't start with really understanding who our ideal customer is. You know, we may go out and build a one page uh, document and call that an ideal customer profile, but it isn't. It isn't. And, and you don't actually know it with depth and conviction. You haven't figured out what their bleeding neck is as you're, you're studying them. You haven't figured out how to message to them correctly. You see, once you start building a lot of those pillars of the foundation, then you can feed those into an AI employee that can then produce fantastic content for you. Okay. And so that's where we're going. That's what we're building. Um, I, I told y'all this was coming a while ago. Uh, a few months ago, I said in, in the newsletter, you're going to start seeing AI video um, from me. And, and it took us a little while. We had a couple little hiccups um, in there. But guess what? After some months of testing, we're here. And it's super exciting. And by the way, this is me. This is not the AI version of me. 